3.11.1, getters and setters drill. I'm I'm going real easy on you on this one, but boy, it's time for you to start stepping up your game, right? So the directions are right here. The directions are here, and I'm not going to give you a how-to video. You actually have to read the directions and figure it out because that's going to be a big part of your future in computer science is the ability to look at specifically how the problem has to get fixed and then fixing it, looking at the directions and making sure your code does what the directions say. That's what this does. So you are going to go here, and it says click here to open the App Inventor and import the setters, getters, and math drills. It's right here. Click that link, or if you click it, it's also here. Once you do, either way, it's going to open a template. It's going to help. I already have it open. And it says right here, there it is. And then the next thing it tells you to do, which it says use the Save As button to rename your project, drills, etc., something like that. So we go in here and we go to Project, Save Project As, and you change the name the way the directions tell you to change the name. Read the directions. Got it? Then you have to do the first five of these apps. They're not that hard once you figure out the first one. It says for each of the following ones, code and solution in the blocks editor. Because you'll see you have all the components you need. You have the label here at the top. You have a text box where the user puts stuff in. And then the box, you use text boxes. Remember in the map tour where you could write in there? You can then, the button makes things happen and the label puts stuff out. And all of these are going to tell you to take what the user puts in and then do stuff with it and put it out in the label. So it's going to say to get what's in the text box, manipulate it in some way, and set the label to say a something, a special something. It may set the label to do some math. It may set the label to do other things. It's going to get the text box, do stuff, and set the label. I've kind of given you as much hint as I can. You have to do one through five, one through five. This is view only. I will also add, just in case we need it, I will also add a Spanish translation of it so that if anybody is struggling with a Spanish translation, you absolutely have the Spanish translation available to you. I will also tell you that if there are other languages here that you're comfortable with, you can feel free to choose any of these languages and make a copy in any language that you find comfortable. Um, I know there's a Swahili translation available. You can totally translate that document, um, and I will include the English and Spanish translations, but you can work in any uh, translation that you want once you make a copy, so you have that agency. Once it's done, go to Screencastify. On Screencastify, it says right there, read the directions. Show your add random value app blocks and working app, please. So when you get to number five, all right, numero cinco, all right, this one, I want to see this one. Got it? Make sure I see this one. This is the one you record, all right? Make sure I see this one, the add a random value app. Make sure that gets put into Screencastify, okay? Any questions? Let me know. Thanks so much. Hello, this is an important message from Regional School District 10.